Alright, so, episode three, Around Every Corner. Mm -hmm. We're going to the city. We're going to find ourselves a boat. Previously on The Walking Dead. Shut up, Carly! Ugh, uh, I've heard yes. enough out of you! Now, what the fuck's the problem? Ooh. Right, that, that, yeah, that happened. You're not coming with us. <sighs> Yeah. I don't know much about you folks, but I can mm. tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll mm. do it. We need to help find a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Yep. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my all, parents were in about Savannah. The boat. Okay, we'll look for them. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! You son of a- ah! Shit! Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me, whether Lee wants you to or not. Uh, now, what I need- Who the fuck? I don't know. But I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. Yeah... Right. Can't I just hold it? Just for a little while? We're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can... Not now. I need you to focus. Mm -hmm. Keep your attention on the street. Okay. Sorry. How's Omid? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. How much farther? Kenny, how much farther to the riverfront? There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there? There sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Have to be. It's going to be okay. Kenny knows what he's doing. What the hell? Oh, someone rang the bell. Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. Oh. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Oh. Someone's up there! Are you sure? Yeah. I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! <laughs> I thought you said that thing didn't work. Mm. Who the hell is this? Hello? Hello? I said answer me! Yeah, we should get going. Probably heed his warning. What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? It tolls for thee. Ah. We 
need to get out of here. Everybody, run! Don't you think? Ben! Oh shit. No, Ben, help her! God damn it, Ben. God damn it. God damn it. Ah. Get out of here. Uh. Uh. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, thank you, old man. Get her the hell out of here. I'll catch up with you. Okay. Move your asses! River Street's right up ahead! That's not all. So is the dead. Oh, give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? Aw, oh, Chuck. Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. Yeah, we're kind of in trouble as well. There's no time. We gotta go now. I'll be fine. Just go. Eh, Chuck can take care of himself. I, I actually trust him, you know, compared to Ben. Man. I'll get the door. You okay? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We've gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. Really? Do they have a sense of smell? Oh, I thought they just can hear. Yeah, they, think we can get in through one of these windows? I scold you. Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place huh. had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. About Clementine. About what happened back there on the street? I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. I hear you. All right. How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck, at least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. I'm going to go check things out. I mean... Right. Okay, so, like... These things, most of these things don't even have no noses. I don't think they can smell. I think they can obviously eat. Just a doghouse. Damn. Looks like something was buried here. Was it a dog? Oh, there's a shovel. A shovel is never not useful. Not thirsty enough to drink that yet. What can they do? Okay. Oh, okay. At the dirt mound. Can I use no this? Won't be able to bust through that. Okay. Oh, we still got our wrench. No William won't be able to bust through that. I can barely even see the text. How's it coming? Found a way in yet? Door's locked up tight. Mm -hmm. Too heavy to force it without making a whole lot of noise. Maybe there's a better way in. Well, if there is, I ain't seeing it. You think maybe someone's still inside? Probably not. Uh, we'd have heard from him by now, all the racket we're making. But whoever mm -hmm. was here did a pretty good job fortifying it. 
Nice place to hole up. We can just figure out how to get in. Hey, how you holding up, man? Lee, I appreciate the interest, but I don't think talking about my feelings right now is gonna help us get inside this house. Hmm. Maybe you should have a look around, see what you can find. Yeah. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. Oh, let me look at the. What's this? Is that a Looks door? like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Well, shit. Every day's a school day. Hmm. Huh. All right. So I didn't know doors like those existed. Here's the dog. I mean, it makes sense, obviously, to avoid burglary and stuff like that. Because, like, honestly, you wouldn't want to have, like, one of those just be open all the time. Like, you know, small animals could get in. So, yeah, we're going to have to... Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. I mean, if... I don't know. Like, if What's mm, buried down there? A dog. We need the collar. Whatever it is, it's been here a while. You, I can smell it from here. Gross. Clementine, honey, come sit with me in Omid. Let Lee work. Oh, God, the smell. All right. Must have belonged to someone. Oh, well, there's a collar. Just gently grab the... I can't get it off. Ugh. Okay, that is not cool. cool. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm fine. Uh, yeah. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? Okay. Hmm. So, we got the collar. Here goes nothing. Yes! God damn! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Mm -hmm. It's no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can... Oh. You okay? What do you see? Clem, what do you see in there? Oh. Ta-da! Uh, good job. Good job, Clem. Yeah, way to go. Might as well praise her. You did good, right? Yes, yeah. you did. You did good. You were a bit hasty, but still. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. Hmm. Uh. Sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. Good. Feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you going to tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was going to tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. 
So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out they there are these stalking days. us. At least the dead don't play games with you. Whoever it was, seems like they're following us. Hmm. And I don't like being followed. Yeah. All the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. I think we could all use a little time to rest up and gather our thoughts, Kitty. At least until those walkers outside wander off and Omid's feeling better. He best feel better quick. I ain't gonna wait around here too long. Place seems secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. Uh -huh. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. You know, I want to say that this place is probably empty, but... Yeah, uh... What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen and Omid need anything, okay? Okay. Yeah. Oh, can we eat dog food? I'm not that hungry. Okay. Besides, I need to finish checking the downstairs. I mean, I've never actually ate dog food. Mm. All empty. Huh. I mean, I'm guessing the rest of the house is pretty empty. Hmm. Oh, the name was Walter. No power. Nothing. Water's off. Well, I mean, the world's gone to hell, so there's no one to maintain anything. Hmm. Must have stopped working a while ago. Whoever cleared this place out left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. I'll take them. Probably not the best idea right now. I need okay. to stay frosty. Okay. I mean, we could have just given it to someone like Omid. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. How's it coming? Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far so good. How's that couch treating you, Omid? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. What do you guys think about this plan of Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. Yeah, I mean, the man lost his family and everything. Same thing with Lily, but... Eh. Yeah. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like, I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. Boat. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. All right. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. 
Mm-hmm. Hmm. Not exactly my style. Yeah. Well, you know, everyone has their own taste when it comes to art. There's a closet. All clear in here. Mm hmm. It's probably just another closet. Oh, no, it's a bathroom. Nothing in here. Oh. Just one more to check. This is a fancy place, I tell you. Mm hmm. Oh. Okay, that was a mop. What? What happened? It's nothing. Just uh, nothing. That's embarrassing. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. Mm -hmm. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee! Okay, we're above the warren. Lee, you need to get up here Tell now. About stranger What's wrong? Danger. It's Kenny. Oh. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Stay here. Kenny? Hmm. Kenny, you okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Oh. Damn. Oh. Kinda looks like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Mm. Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Before it was your own son. Now it's just a kid who needs your help. You can do this, Kenny. You need to do this. Mm. I know. I just... Oh, God. Yeah. Here. Here. This will make it clean and quick. I don't know that I can do it, Lee. 
Should I, should I motivate him? Yeah. I know that you can. I couldn't even help my own boy. That was your own flesh and blood. No father could have done that. Mm. But you can help this boy. Do what's right for him. Send him on his way. I don't know if this is a... I mean, okay, we helped Kenny. I, I guess this is helping. We should bury him. Hmm. I'll take care of it. Yeah. I mean, we have a shovel outside and everything, so yeah. At least we now know the place is empty. Hmm. He's far too kind. He's an ass, but he doesn't actually—he does actually care. He's just super weak when it came to his family. I mean, I can't blame the man. He lost his wife, and then lost his son. Yeah, the wife couldn't handle the grief. The son was fit, so yeah. All right. Like for Kenny, he, he's just Ken. Mm -hmm. I guess it's appropriate to bury him with the dog. If he was separated from his family, he wouldn't have not been much of an ass to everyone else. Hmm. I don't know. But yeah. I mean, maybe if his wife was still alive, but... Yeah. Alright, let's... Okay, why am I still looking at this? I thought I was gonna bury it. Hmm. <sighs> okay. And now we bury. Do I have to do this manually? Okay. I do. Yeah. Listen, it, the wa the dead may be walking, but at least we still respect the dead mm -hmm. all right I actually have to do this manually okay I think one one more will do it yeah okay Oh. Hey! Hey! Who are you? What the hell do you want from us? Lee, what's going on? Hmm. I thought I saw something outside the fence. Something? Or someone didn't get a good enough look. Someone the way they move, though, mm -hmm. too fast to be a walker. Could it have been the guy that's been following us? The voice on the radio? I don't know. They didn't say anything. Just stood there watching. Probably. Yeah. Hell. So yeah, that confirms the stalker, pretty much. Kenny, I'm fine. I just, I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Hmm. Lee thinks he might have seen someone out there spying on us. Maybe it's that goddamn bell ringer. Man, remember when walkers were what we were most afraid of? Those yeah. are starting to seem like the good old days. Well, the hell with this. I'm not gonna let whoever's out there keep us from getting our boat. We've holed up here long enough. 
I'm heading down to River Street. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well, then hell, what are we waiting for? I'll oh. go get my stuff. No, right. Ben, you'll only slow us down. Oh. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. Okay. You stay behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. We need to focus on finding a boat right now, Claire. Like we talked about on the train, remember? Now okay. Kelly kind of waited Daylight's a burning. Longer. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Mm -hmm. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. So, you're mm. just gonna leave me on the bench here? I'm worried about Omid. Just, He's in yeah. bad shape. I need you to stay here. Keep an eye on him. Mm-hmm. He's got Krista for that. Trusted if it comes ben down to it, I me. can't rely on Krista to do what has to be done. Mm. Not with Clementine yeah. in the same house. You I don't think he'll saying? die of that yeah. leg wound, though. You can count on me. Good. I think he'll be fine. Like, I know she's worried about the infection, but... Yeah, I, I don't know. You think everyone's safe back at the house? Safe as anyone can be these days, I guess. Mm. I just hate leaving Clementine alone. As if walkers weren't bad enough, now we got this crazy motherfucker on the radio stalking us. Won't be a problem once we get out on the water. River's just a few blocks up ahead. Again with the bell? Son of a bitch! That bastard's fucking with us again! It's another trap! No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Oh. Whatever it is, it's going to get the dead moving over there. So, they're trying to help us? I mean, it looks like it. What in the hell is going on? I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. Mm. Hmm. Let's keep moving. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Oh my god. Damn. There's no boats. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. <sighs> Are you B. sure about that? Doesn't look like it to me. Uh -huh. Maybe we need to start thinking about a plan B. This is the plan, Lee. This is our best and only shot. You said so yourself back at the house. You agreed with me. Yeah, but that was before we... This one might still be salvageable. You better be right about this. I said it might be. Give me a fucking break. I'm a fishing captain, not a miracle worker. 
I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the hmm. other end. I yeah. don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right oh. here. See what you can find. Okay. Right. Mm hmm. Can he really want two boats? Hmm. Oh, wow. Put him on spikes. And they're still alive. Fuck. What is this meant to be? Some kind of warning? We'll do something like this. Yep. Probably not a good idea to shoot him down. I think we'll just leave him. What am I trying to do? Attract more walkers? This barricade does a good job of making me not want to go any further. Mm hmm. Yeah. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Some sort of code, I guess. Hey, let me go actually go check. I kind of just like went over there. Let's see, can we find some boats? Great. Needs a quarter to work. Ah. Oh. I need a coin. Can I just pry it open? Damn. Built solid. Hmm. Okay. Any coins in the back alley? I don't see anything. Oh, right, cash register. Hmm. Maybe there's some change in the drawer. Hello, beautiful. Empty. Aww. Yeah, that would have yeah. been too easy. Someone already looted the place. I should probably stick close to Kenny. It's too dangerous out here. I need to find a coin. Sadly, I don't have those uh, 60 cents Larry had. Oh, can I bust this open? Locked. Maybe I could use my tool? Oh, hey. 25 cents. Sweet. Gas siphoned, tires removed. Engine parts missing. Damn. Looks like this thing has been stripped clean. Yeah. Can't say there'll be any like working vehicles going further. Or boats. Must have been a hell of a wreck. Someone must have been trying to back their boat into the water. Only things didn't go as planned. Yeah. Seemed like they were trying to they too were trying to escape by the boat. And they just couldn't make a float. Jesus. I don't know, does this look salvageable? Eh. I mean, maybe if they were able to get it off the car. Alright. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the waterline, Was well, someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the? Yeah. What the hell is that? I just noticed. A fate worse than death. Mm -hmm. Hmm. 
Abandoned, like every other place in this city. Is that a hotel? Oh, there's another boat over there. That one's salvageable. Okay, so yeah, seems like they got their boat sunk. Nothing but water, mm. not a boat to be seen. I gotta wonder for those who tried to escape on a boat. Oh, what the heck? What the hell? Huh. Oh, wow, she knows of the parkour. Get down! Get down! We hiding. Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? You know what? Sounds yeah. Like a plan. Let's go okay. introduce ourselves. You head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. I saw an ice pick Just in their hand. Talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. Hello. Mind if I buy a newspaper? What the? Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Wow. Oh. 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 Nice face mask. Oh. Eh. Lee? Oh, how, what, what are you doing here? Yeah. You're not from Crawford. You're a woman. Crawford? What the hell are you talking about? Hmm. Mind if I get up? Slowly. But oh, Kenny, come on. Kenny, don't. Ooh. Oh, damn it, Kenny. No, he's with us. Who the hell are you people? I ask you first. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. Seriously, Clem, how did you get here? Did you follow us? You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? No, I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. What's the okay. deal with this Crawford place? You sure you want to know? I might as well, since we're here. When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So uh, how'd you know we weren't them? A dictatorship. Hmm. Because there are no children in Crawford. Really? Not anymore. Huh. But why? What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Really? Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. Sounds like a That's shitty community. That's how they survived, while the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, right. just the opposite when you think about it. Are you sure they're alive in there? Because I feel like they would have came after us then. What exactly did Crawford do with all these burdens? What happened to them? 
Well, you met some of them already. Oh. Wow. Fuck me. Yeah, that's fucked, honestly. Yeah. Anyone who got sick, anyone too old, anyone they figured wasn't strong enough to survive. To them, those people were just mouths to feed, a drain on their precious resources. Yeah. Wow. How do you know all this? They made a wall out of them? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Huh. been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah. yeah. Well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raised the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart with the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Mm, we're looking for boats. Came down here looking for you know, a boat. Hoping to get our people all out of here. Find boats. something safe. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Hmm. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron! You want to keep your voice down? Shit. Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before... Great. We, yeah, we can't do that. A horde kind of like was following us. Yeah. Isn't that the... The way we came. Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a... Yeah, no. You're just gonna let her go? Hey! You can't just leave us here! Really? Watch! No! Please! Please don't leave us! Come on! Make it fast! Okay, thank you. Oh, fuck me! Okay, okay. Come on, come on, hurry! Can you go, Kenny? You got time to pick me up? Come on! Come on, man. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, come on. No! Oh, boy. Hey, I'm gonna move this aside. Maybe I should move it again to block him. No? Okay. Nope, there's more in front of me. I am uh, kind of surrounded. Come on, Lee! Get your ass out of there! Sewer. God, can't get it open! Here, use that to pry it open. Thank you. Let me use that. And away we go. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. All right, sewer level it is. That was a close one, I tell you. Mm -hmm. Another close one, may I add. Clementine, can you hear me? Yeah, no, they can't hear If us. you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Well, maybe we can't hear them. We can't go back up. Mm. 
All right, well. Feel solid. No way I can pry that open. Huh. Oh. Was there anything over there in the front? Okay, I can't even go there. All right, well, I will go through the open one. Hmm. Okay. What do we got? Open passageway. Mm. It's a drainage pipe. Oh. That's, uh... That's rough. Take on all of those things by myself. Hmm. Oh. All right. Looks like some kind of drainage pipe. All right, let's try turning it. Won't turn anymore in that direction. Okay, we turn it right. Oh, did the water distract them? Good thing I'm out here, and not in there. Hmm, seems loose. Oh, yep. Shit. Alright, can we go any further? Seems like it. out pretty well. Nope. Wait, what? Where's the dead? Oh, what the fuck? I didn't see where he was. Oh, they were still over there? Huh. Okay, that kind of sucked because, you know. Okay. okay I gotta do this again. I think I had to distract them, maybe? Hmm. Probably we should have actually put the valve on the... Yeah, probably should have used the valve. Good thing I'm out here. Mm -hmm. There's not in there. Hmm. Seems loose. Shit. Yeah, so that one that was blocking my way actually got me. Won't go anymore in that direction. Okay, we gotta take this then. Try turning it to the left this time. No. Okay, so it's got to turn to the right. Oh. I should probably 
we get going. Yeah. Here they come. Alright, I guess I gotta wait for them to keep moving. Is there any more stragglers? Okay. There's probably that one, right? No? Okay. Uh, up and up there's still that one over there. Time to move. Uh, oh, is okay. Wow. Oh my god. Chuck. Chuck. You must have tried to hide out down Damn. here. Poor bastard. No bullets. He must have saved the last one for himself. Man. You deserve better, old man. Yeah. <sighs> I thought he could handle it. That's that sucks. Mm-hmm. Alright. I'm gonna take care of that one. Oh. Oh. Oh come on. Damn it! Don't don't yell at it. Just fuck. come on. Oh shit. Okay. Ooh. I best if we don't make any noise. Mhm. Mm no way I could pick that up on my own. Mm. Uh, Looks like somebody saw the damn thing off. Really? What about this? Those bars are way too solid. Can I use this? I'm not gonna be able to pry these bars with this. Okay, yeah, that's pretty dumb to think. Is there a door over here or something? Hmm. Mm. Perfect. Can I pry this open though? Yeah. Shit, it broke off. Wait, no, that's bad. <laughs> uh. I already tried that. It ain't gonna hmm. budge. Can I pick up the handle? Wait, hold up. It's just a sign. Mm. Uh, okay. Hmm. Damn, I can't reach it. Don't think that's gonna help me find a way out of here. Hmm. Alright, could I use this to climb up? Oh yeah, just do like the girl with the parkour. What the hell? Uh Okay, we discovered a secret though. Mm-hmm. Wow. Secret tunnel. Hmm. A fallout shelter. Oh. Oh. Huh. Okay. Must have been one of those old nuclear fallout shelters. Yeah, this place are pretty well stocked. Wonder if someone's living down here. Probably. It could Look either be alive this. or dead. It's enough to keep people alive for months. Damn. Why Crawford didn't get to it? Once we're in Crawford. I mean, we are, but is this place? Oh. Uh. <laughs> hello. hello. Uh, I don't want any it's trouble. All right. Kind of okay. fell down the sewers. Uh, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he oh, goes back, come on. find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? 
They don't lie to me. I'll know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I think you better start talking. I'm not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. Mm -hmm. I have a brother in Macon. You were there? How was it? As bad as here? Yeah. I'm sorry. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Mm. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. Not from I'm not Crawford. From Crawford. Come on. But I saw what they did up there. Yeah. It made me sick. I'm not like them. And I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Keep back, or I swear I'll shoot. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. You're really not from Crawford? No, I'm really not. Well, uh, mm. we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so the perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Mm -hmm. I mean, we might as well be get honest. Out of here. Like, get back to my own people. Yeah. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Yeah, I could probably be fine on my. I think I can figure out my own mm -hmm. way back. Vern, you're not just gonna let him go back out there alone, are you? Those sewers are like a maze. He's got no chance of finding his way back without a guide. Really? You're not gonna be able to get out of here on your own, but we all got our own problems. Mm. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? Look, I'm sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? You know what? Nah. No. She lost her real parents. Let's be I'm honest. Doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. Mm hmm. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost mm -hmm. her in the first days. I'll Damn. be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. Mm -hmm. We need you here. You're a good man. Don't worry. I'll be back before okay. you know it. Let's go. Yeah, sure thing, I guess. Clementine? Clem? Oh. Did they make it back? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? I'm the one who saved his ass back at the river. Who's the fossil? Hey, the doctor. This is Vernon. He's a doctor. He helped me get back here after we got separated. I think you have something that belongs to me. Ah, uh, yeah. Here you go. It was a good pick. Mm -hmm. Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. 
He's gotten worse. Really? Much worse. We have a man wounded. Mm. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Yeah. Oh, thank God. Could you take this, a look at him? This is actually a good, big coincidence. You have to help us. Please. Hmm. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Omid, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Yeah, like, where's Clem? Hmm. I forgot to ask that to Molly. Clementine. It's... Yeah. Clementine? Where is she? she Clementine, there? you here? Clem? Ain't got time for that. Hmm. Hello. I mean, it's a big house, but what are you doing? Oh, uh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me. I'm not her keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Hmm. Why don't you go bug them? Okay. So she was last seen downstairs. Clem? Clementine? Clementine, come out, please. Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good oh, job. Drunk. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. You want to throw down again like back on the train? Because I fight better when I'm shit faced. What the fuck were you thinking letting Kenny get like this? Hey man, I tried, but he gave me a look like he was gonna rip my face off. He won't listen to you. You think he was gonna listen to me? It's whatever. To yeah. hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked! Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? I mean, you have the point, but... Mm. Okay. That Clementine, where are you? AIDS drink. Where is she? Doesn't look like she's in here. Where'd you go? You know, let's ask Ben. At least he's not drunk. Have either of you seen Clementine? Damned if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, how did Clementine sneak out of the house? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic, and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. I think she went out to play in the backyard. On her own? With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She better be or it's your ass. Well, so I, I mean, oh God. Uh, Clementine? Clementine! Not outside. Uh, this is bad. <sighs> OK. 
Okay, well... Don't think he's in the doghouse. I don't think he can actually fit in there. Try to open it. Oh. Wee. Oh. Oh. Okay. What were you doing in there? Exploring. And hmm. look, look what I found. God damn, we found a boat. Wow. This was here the whole time? I know, right? No one ever checks the garage. God damn. Look at that, Kenny. We found you a boat. intact as well. Hmm. Old Mead's doing okay? as well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Mm. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Yeah, I guess. Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Uh, give me some news. How about bad? Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. Mm. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Crawford. Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Yep. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. Mm. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. That's putting it mildly. We're armed and we've got the numbers. I say we just go in there and take what we need by force. Okay, that is and literally okay, the that, dumbest that's idea that's I have actually ever dumb, heard. Now I think about it. Crawford's like a goddamn <laughs> military base. They've in. got hundreds of people in there armed to the teeth. And that perimeter's guarded day and night. You're really? gonna have to be smarter than that. Hmm. Oh, maybe we can be. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. Hmm. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Okay. That's not bad. That's better. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. 
Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? Anyone else have a problem with this plan? Because we're gonna need every one of us to pull this off. Man, I don't know. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered uh -huh. prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what gonna be dangerous? Crawford. Yeah. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah. yeah. It it's is. gonna be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better mm -hmm. and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Neither do I, Clem, yep. but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. I guess I should go get ready. Oh, uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Yeah. Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Hmm. Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Yeah, that's true. Mm. Can't I come with you? Yeah, we make a good team. I, I can't okay. deny her. Then come. But you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're yep. told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. Because, like, if she sees that her parents are not there... Yeah. Hopefully she doesn't believe the man on the radio, I'll tell you that. Like, honestly, I thought for a second when you were looking for it, the man on the radio took her. Hmm. Alright. Time to get looting. Check out what I found in the garage. Hmm. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Damn. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Wow. Nice. No one really Can checked the garage. Maybe because all What's the lines and stuff, I but took yeah. another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So we're going to have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't going to hold more than five people, even with one of them a kid. Me, hmm. you, Clem, Krista, Omi, Ben, Polly. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut my I don't. Loose, I don't even think... This is over, we're gonna have to make a decision. I don't even think Omi or Krista serious. wants to join us. I'm just saying, if we want the best chance of... Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. Okay. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. So we can leave. Clementine. Hold up just a sec. Mm, you ready? Just, uh, ready. Hey, whoa, Back hold on a minute. Uh, You're not Molly. taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I, I have, said like, room about the kind like, of place Crawford is? Probably ben. If you take her in there and they find her... I'm not leaving her alone in the house with only Omi to protect her. It's just not happening. For what it's worth, I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I mean, Ben's trying to help. I can't really give him too much shit, honestly. He's trying to make up for the shit he caused. 
This should be it. We're right underneath. At the same time, he might he may have like, kept us safe us. temporarily. Okay, people, this is it. Remember the plan. We go in hard, hit them by surprise, grab what we need, and get the hell out. We need to do this fast, so everybody stay sharp, stay alert, and stay close together. Got it? And that part about staying close, that goes double for you. All righty then. Hmm. Oh, we're out. Let's go. Where is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. It's too I think I quiet. See one over there by the door. Okay, me and Kenny will take this guy out. On my signal, the rest of you follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's mm. do this quiet. All right. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. How's it going? Hey, how's it going? Do me a favor and put your hands up nice and slow. What the fuck? Oh. oh. Might have been a mistake. Oh wow, this place is dead. Yup. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Okay. Get inside! Fast! Yep. Damn, this place is dead. I wonder what ha I wonder how this happened. Like, what, what the fuck? This is the place supposed to be like, you know, the most strongest force in town. Damn. Certainly that didn't last long. Fuck! Fuck! Do you think they saw us? Oh yeah. Definitely. Definitely. If I'm gonna be honest. Oh no, I scared Clem. What the mm. hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. <sighs> what always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. All it takes is one person, I guess. No. You know. This is good. At least we don't have to worry about any actual humans. You know. Yeah, he's right. Vernon's right. We can deal with walkers easier than armed guards. That's true. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Man, we're going to be in I and think out. I know which way to head. Now I'm worried about Ben snapping. I got a bad feeling about this. Mm-hmm. Well. Okay, so. I'm gonna presume that they're dead inside based on the sound. Huh. Just yep. keep moving. Seems like they tried to pr protect this place. Here. Probably like box some of the walkers inside. I don't know. Looks okay. Everybody in. like they were using this room as some kind of command center. 
Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Didn't we bring someone for that? Here. Oh. Just give me a sec. So we got fuel, medicine, battery, medicine? Where would be the best place to look for medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. Mm. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Oh, you know, you're probably from here. Any idea where we could find a battery? Uh, maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Makes yep, sense. It's called Herman's. You can't miss it. What about the fuel? Where should I start looking? Mm. There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If mm. they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Okay. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. Mm -hmm. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. Yep. It sounds like a good plan. No one die. What about me? What can I do? Um, I need you to stay here with Ben yeah. and watch over our command center. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? Yeah, take care of Ben, please. You're leaving me with Ben? I'm not leaving you with Ben. I'm leaving him with you. <laughs> Understand? Yeah. Oh, okay. Back before you know it. Mm-hmm. I like how that just made her more confident. <laughs> All right. The Georgia State flag. What the fuck? A lot of history there. <laughs> Not that it matters much second. now, I guess. God, I'm so glad I got stream delay so I can just see these funny glitches. Nothing but crayons and construction paper. Mm. All right. Hopscotch. Ah. Hey, you need any help with that? Thanks, I got it. Just once, I'd like to do something useful, you know? Hmm. Huh. That'd make a nice change of pace. <laughs> wow, no need to agree with me quite so uh, much. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Well, uh, I'll let you get on with it. All right. Ben's no, wait. Go well, okay. There is something you can help me really? with. Really? Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. Okay. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, hmm. I've gotten to know him a little better. Uh -huh. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. Ben, you're not Listen, you're gonna get man, kicked off the boat, it's Ben. It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. Ben, how am I supposed to just it's my fault. something like that around? I I, I have technically to tell him. Compromise is your supply thing. Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking mind? Kenny's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might do. I know. I've thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling I'm him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real. Real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. I can't just pretend it never happened. You're gonna get kicked off the boat, man. I'll be honest Kenny. with you. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever gonna get out of here. So yeah. you need to keep this to yourself for the good of everyone. You hear me? Listen, you don't want to have you. Ken remind Kenny of his family. This. You don't want to remind him of his family. Okay, let, let him just focus on his boat. Mm-hmm. No power, no TV. 
Yeah, you do be like that. Any books on history? Creepy. Yeah. Might come back for these later. Looks like something Any like voodoo dolls. Be nice once we get on that boat. Huh. Huh. Again with that symbol. Looks like they had quite a system here. Huh. Crawford's final solution. I still wait. Hold on. Oh, they actually tell me what it means. Number one. Number of illegible civilians found. Number two. Number of civilians brought to Carford. Initials of a person's condensing search. And days since the outbreak. Okay, so it's been. So right here, it looks like when it was made, it was been 71 days. S seven. Wait, no, 71. Seven thousand and a hundred days? I don't know. Number of walkers found. Hmm. Yeah, they had a system. For sure. Too bad they couldn't have kept them alive with it. I mean, they probably did, but yeah. All it takes is just one infected person. Kind of like what Ben said before at the school. Yep. One person dies. They come back to life, and yeah, it's hell on earth. Hmm. The alleyway to the auto shops down this here. Jesus, you coming or not? Where Bree said the fuel was. Okay, being Molly, you scared me for a second. God damn, <laughs> where are you? Shell casing's all over. Whatever happened here wasn't good. I feel like the vo well, let me check. I feel like the volume is too low. All right, just yeah, you customers, let me know if it's too loud. Hmm. Especially when Lee's talking to himself, it gets like the quietest. This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. Where the hell is Molly? She went somewhere. Molly, you out here? Hmm. She gonna guess I'm not going that way. Okay. I thought I was gonna be jump scared. Auto shop must be down this way. Okay. Uh, well, climbing the fence isn't an option. Yep, too barbed up. Motors will be shot on sight. Damn. Well, they're all dead, so no need to worry about them. Hmm. Is there another way we can make a make it around? I feel like I'm missing something. Oh. Right. An opening in the ceiling, and I could easily climb up those shelves. Hmm. Ooh. Okay, not bad. Alright, so right here. What do we got? Oh. Damn, it's jammed tight. Mm hmm. Seriously, where is Molly? <laughs> oh. Better not get too close. Yeah.
He's mine. Okay then. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Sounds like she had some uh, unfinished Molly. business. What? Think you got I him? Think <laughs> you got him? One more for luck. All right. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Or yeah, was? Well, he ain't shit now. Mm-hmm. Did you find us a way in? Yeah. Yeah. But the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh. Oh yeah. That'll work. Wait, a car jack. Oh. Yeah, you might have attracted some attention with your probably unfinished business, I'm presuming. God damn it, that's not gonna hold. Hmm. Well, that sucks. Come on! Hmm. Alrighty, let's crank it up. Crank, 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 crank. We are out of here. Oh, what you do didn't aim for the head. Didn't aim for the head, Molly. The unfinished business is still unfinished. Uh, <laughs> Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. All right. Oh, hey, that car looks like it's on. That blinking must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery yeah. being in that car. If I can find. I'm in a good chance. That's confirmed. There. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Mm, can I press the button? No power. Darn. It's locked. No way in. How's it locked on the inside? Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Mm. Perfect. All right, well, I'm going to have to, like, get on top of this thing. Something you need? What was all that about back there? He came at me up on that rooftop, tried to take a bite out of me, so I took care of business. What, you got a problem with me killing geeks? No. Nah. It just seemed like you went to town on him a little more than you needed to. Hey, you never really know when those things are all the way dead. I was even... just making sure. Look, you, you want to get this battery sure. or not? Time's wasting. You the bar you Think hook. I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't hmm. know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? That's what I call her. Oh. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. Oh, that's nice. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. All right. I mean, come on. I've used her to, like, pry open doors and stuff. Looks like Crawford had their own semi-trucks. Hmm. I can't reach it up there. All right. Can I use this to pry it open? I did it. Oh, okay. Whoa, whoa! Ooh. That's probably not good. No shit! Uh, let me disconnect the battery. I'll try to hold him off. Hurry! Okay. There's the battery. Finally, something goes right. Yeah. Still attached to the terminals. Oh, stop. Still the, attached to the terminals. Well, fuck. Where's the terminal? I don't know cars. Uh, Still attached to the terminals. Fuck. It's off. Oh, oh, I had the freaking okay. I I'm a mate. I off. ain't no mechanic, chat. Got it. 
Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. All right. Thanks, Molly. Okay, follow me. Okay. Oh, they're getting in. Move your ass. Sure thing. Luckily, there's a ladder over here. Oh. Ah. Okay. Oh, great. Now they're rocking it. Skylight. Hmm. It's shot. Shoot it out. Oh, thank you. Gun. Yes. I don't think the noise matters. Hey, uh, Molly, help me out. Thank you, girl. Alright, that was rough. Okay, so now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Okay, then. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! No. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, man. Ah. Ooh. Yeah. At least we made it. Phew. Come on. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Come on. Wait, you've still got the battery. I have yeah, it? I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. Oh. See you back in class. Molly! All right. God damn it, what the hell is she doing? I mean, fair. You still have more infinite business, I'm guessing? Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. All righty then. What? Oh. Little help here! Oh, shit. Okay, you guys were <laughs> had quite the adventure. God, his head is in the way. Please do something! Ah. Uh, good idea. We got it. Break the door with something! How about this? Ah. Uh, oh. Right, that's not gonna hold at all. Hold. Damn well better. There's so many of them. You got the fuel. Let's not start high fiving each other just we yet. Should Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Well, I don't know if there's anything. It's a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. I, I don't think there's anything we can use to barricade that door though. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think we can move those lockers or anything. You're back. Yeah, and we made out pretty good, too. Great work, Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Mm. Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. Yeah. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Otherwise, we're gonna have to find her. Dead or alive. All right, what, what's up here with the door? What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. Oh, uh, yeah. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. I just told well, you. Well, she better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? Saved my life? What are you life? guys doing with that door? Slower than I'd like. Don't worry, we'll get it open. I think. Okay. Guess I gotta go help find the medicine. Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. Hmm. No problem. We're all on the same team. So you're a cancer survivor, like Vernon and the others. Yeah, hmm. I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been oh, getting wow. treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, when I thought there might be some hope, all this happened. 
Yeah, that sucks. Lost my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Mm. Funny how things work out, huh? How long have you known Vernon? A couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? Mm. I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together, kept us alive. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? I'd rather not talk about it. Too many awful memories. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now, with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They weeded out the sick and the old, even children, those yeah. least able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins. Whatever happened here, however Crawford fell, I consider it poetic justice. Damn, girl, that's cold. It's how I feel. If you'd seen what I seen, you'd feel the same. Mm hmm. I mean, it makes sense. I'm a little busy here, Lee. Maybe mm. you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. I got the battery. Just now I gotta go probably help find the medicine. So. So, according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed, medicine might be at the nurse's office. And a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. Okay, well, I've already went to the auto shop, so yeah. If we're gonna find medicine anywhere, that would be the place to look. Bree said the entrance to the auto shop was in the alleyway by this fire escape. Okay, I've already gotten that done. Uh, the fuel's in a shed across from the playground. Mm. It's just outside the stairwell. We're already good on fuel, so yeah, medicine. Let's go find it. Yeah, we should really barricade. Like, honestly, I, I don't trust that hatchet holding, you know? They've already been fired. They're worthless. Can we go this way? Oh, we can. Oh, this is the exit to the alley, though. Yeah, we already went down there, so... Shit. Oh. Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. This is gonna suck. Which one should I shoot? One. Oh, okay, they're all coming at me now. Two, three, four, fuck, 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 okay, I missed like two shots, mm. oh, hi, what the hell happened, they wandered into the hallway after we got inside, I think they must have heard us rooting around in here, the whole place is infested, they're everywhere, Calm down. I took care of them. Yep. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Hmm. Oh, they're behind a locked safe. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds oh. in that safe. Locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open? Maybe with enough time. But I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Maybe we can find, like, something. I'll have to take time to rest later, I think. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. Hmm. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. Looks like some kind of medical file. Phones probably haven't worked in months. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, wait, there's a camera. No tape inside. Huh. Okay. This was pointed right here. What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. 
Oh. They look pregnant. There's dried blood on this printout. And on the floor. Hmm. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? Yep. Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Molly helped me get the battery we needed. That's great. One down. Where is she? She took off. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. Took off? With the battery? Yeah. Don't worry. She'll be back. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team player. More the mercenary kind. How much time do you think Omid has, Doc? You want my medical opinion? The sooner we get him some strong antibiotics to start fighting that infection, the better. Hmm. Let's just leave it at that, huh? Hey, Doc, uh, I just wanted to thank you for coming with us and for all your help. I really appreciate it. Don't mention it. It's times like these we've got to help each other the most, right? And we're no better than those Crawford sons of bitches. I heard that. That is true. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Mm -hmm. Good idea. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything else in here for me to do. Hmm. Maybe I should go back outside to the alleyway? Like, uh, yeah, like, wasn't there, like, a doctor? Not, not anything about it, yeah. There was a doctor outside, so he probably had the code for this place. Not going back out there unless I have a damn good reason. Well, okay, well, that place is pretty filled up with walkers. Okay, then. Hold up. Can't open it without the combination. Oh. Like, out of all these lockers, this one stood out. Wow. No one under 14. Really? So Ben could have made it in here. Do the blood bleed? Okay, it did lead outside. I went to over here with the camera. Hmm. Oh, did I not check the file? Oh. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. Huh. And what's this? A tape. Did you guys not see this? Hmm. It's a medical file for a woman named Correa. Okay then. Yeah, let's use it on the camera. Hmm. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. 
If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Uh, that sucks. Yeah. Damn it! We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers yeah. out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Probably another tape, maybe. Mm -hmm. I guess we got a reason to go outside now. Alright, let's go. <laughs> oh. Well, so I was lucky. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, he was alive still. To check them. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Oh, uh, that's a locker combination. Shit, time to go. Yep. Logan. Logan. This must have been his locker. Another tape. Hmm. A safe combination has got to be on one of these. I found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Uh huh. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes, if this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day, when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Ah! Ooh. No. No. 
Okay. So that's probably how it all started. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hmm. hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. Can you get like one more tape though? We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine. We take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. I guess I'll look at it myself then. Mm hmm. Yep. No tape inside. Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Hmm. Yeah, Damn. that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Okay, then. At least we know the hitch. Yep. Well, shit. Yeah. I guess we know Molly's story here. Yeah, let's just keep that to ourselves. I don't think that's something we would want to share with the group, you know? Yeah. Jesus oh! Christ! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. Oh my god, Molly. I'll take that battery now. Second oh, page. yeah. Uh, about that. What? I'm just kidding. Molly, I know your story. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. Oh. When the dead yeah. started walking and Crawford shut itself in, uh, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. Yeah. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by mm. Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret, kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked, how anything was better than becoming one of them, but I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Mm. Yeah. This is all I have left of her. Mm. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. 
I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Bonnie. I understand. She's pretty. What the mm -hmm. hell? What? I what think that's our cue to get the hell out of okay. here. Okay. I was gonna say, it wasn't. Wait. Where is the axe? Where is the axe? Man, we should have barricaded that door. Oh, Jesus! Oh, shit. Ben. Man, sorry, ben. sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Did you leave Clementine alone? No, Kenny's with her. We still can't open that armory door. You sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Why do you think, Ben? Oh, shit! Ah, man. Oh, okay, Ben, go use that though. Oh, right. Lee, shoot this fucker! Oh. Thanks. Okay. They did it wasn't me. I'm going. Kid. Oh wow! Nice Holy shit! Thanks. Damn. I taught that girl well. Mm -hmm. What the fuck is going on? Father. They're coming. Oh shit! That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Uh. Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Okay. Come on, damn you! This is my fault, all my fault. The hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked uh. about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, ben. man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, we, save it for we later. We don't have ben. time, Ben. We don't have time for ben. this now. I'm sorry, Lee. I can't do this anymore. He's got a right to know. Know what? It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Why'd you have to bring it up, man? Why'd you gotta bring it up, you see? Ah, kick his ass later, come on. I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. We gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pissant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You got them both fucking killed! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Uh, not the time, Molly. Uh, if this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! You know Ben didn't mean any harm. He was just trying to help. And I'm supposed to give a crap about his good intentions? The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well, but all I want to do is get back to Omid, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Of course. Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? I abstain. I can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. Oh, what wait, about maybe the I rest of us? Don't we get a say? Oh! 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 Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on. Yeah, he, he, that happened. So much for the armory. What's left of it? Hmm. A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. <sighs> All right. 
never mind. Fuck! Have a good day. It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs. Can we put like a door, like a freaking door behind it or something? Wait, chair. Look. Thanks. Why don't we just use a chair? Uh, uh out of here. That one's crawling too close. Oh, my leg. Oh, fuck. Come on. Get me out. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. Okay. Uh, give me up. Look up. Shoot. Pull. Look up. Shoot. Pull. Look up. Okay. Oh, what? How much around it? How much around it? Okay, great. They came to the other door. Now we're in a tight spot right now. That sucks. Alright, time to go hatch it. Go. That's one. That's gonna be two. And th three, three? Okay, we'll just kick him off. Out of the way, please. I'm coming through. Oh. Shit. Oh, there, go. oh, there goes my hatchet. It was a good hatchet as well. Come on! Alright. It's all right, Clint. I'm fine. Mm. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. I mean, well, we what are we waiting for? Go, go! We, we did come in from the railway, or... Okay. Yeah, it's the horde. <laughs> They're finally coming into town. Yeah, come on, let's go! Oh, fuck. What the fuck? Ben. Oh, Ben. I got you. I've got you! Climb up! Come on, you can do it! There's no time! You have to go! Now! Oh, come on! Turn around, ben. Come on! Ben. Let go, damn it! Get Clem and the others out of here! Lee! <sighs> oh, come on. Okay, now you're being a piece of shit now, Kenny. Uh... We, we both know. Not even helping. Let me go. Uh, I guess Sayonara, Ben. Sayonara. Uh, I mean, it's what he wanted. He wasn't giving me second thoughts. He... Oh my god, you idiot. He's not even dead. <laughs> He's not even dead. Died a dumbass. Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! I never she should dead? have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Oh. <laughs> no, no, he's alive. Hey. Back already? <laughs> oh my god. We got you medicine. Oh me, do you I are such a dramatic. Feel like I could use some Sano awakening. Where's Ben? Ah. Uh, <sighs> didn't make it. What happened? Dumb son of a bitch nearly got us all killed. Lee stepped up and did what he had to. That's what happened. Oh. 
Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. You did the right thing. Oh, shut Trust up. Me. She'll understand. Man, I hope so. I, no. I'm gonna go start work on the boat. I kind of pissed her off. Okay, with a little luck, right. you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk hmm. in private. Yeah, what's up? Listen, man, about what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. Hmm. There was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. <laughs> when I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. Uh huh. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, mm -hmm. we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? No. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this mm -hmm. and give you a chance to walk away. What you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. I've anyone who tries to get between survive. me and her, anyone, is going to wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. I mean, she wouldn't have liked it. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. Really? What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right you now. you had a room on the boat. But you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Really? It sounds like it'd be pretty crowded. And I never <sighs> did like the water. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. Well, that doesn't make sense. Where's she going, though? Hmm. Huh. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? What happened to Ben? What did Kenny mean when he said you did what you had to? Clem.
fail. You have to believe me. I tried to save him, but Ben didn't want me to. What do you mean? What Ben did was very brave. He knew we were running out of time, and that saving him might put everyone else in danger. So he told me to leave him behind so the rest of us could get away. I know that's difficult to understand. I understand. You do? Yeah. He thought about other people before he thought about himself. Hmm. My mom always told me that's what makes a good person. Well, she was right. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? <sighs> yeah. Sure. We'll look before we leave. Really? You'll take me to Crawford so we can look? <sighs> I knew you didn't really mean it. Mm, God damn it. Hey there. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. Don't cry. <sighs> Clementine? Oh, where'd she go? Clementine? Wait, did we put the radio down though? Where's it in our pocket again? I mean, I feel like either or, she wouldn't have liked the answer, honestly. Why, why, is, why is this place so empty? Where is everyone? Huh? Clementine? Clementine! What? God. What? What happened? Why? What? Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, no. Crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Uh... No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Hmm. Okay. What do you need from us? Clint may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her I if we all go together. I don't have much time, honestly, at Who's this point. We're all responsible for Clementine. Mm. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Mm -hmm. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. 
So that's settled then. We'll All look right. for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Thank you. Thanks, Thank you. you guys. I appreciate it. Really. You've always been there for me, Lee. Always had my back when it mattered. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Bitten or not, I'm with you to the end. You can count on me. Mm. Thank okay, you, Kenny. guys, we should go find Vernon. See if he took her. Let's head out. What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? If someone was gonna take it, they'd have done it already. Besides, what choice do we have? Hmm. gone huh where the hell are they looks like they got out of here in a hurry Vernon get out here there doesn't have to be any trouble here all I want is the girl they're gone give her back and nobody needs to get hurt Clementine, are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Where have you taken her? This isn't Vernon. Hmm. And you should really watch your tone. Oh. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Hmm. Wow. Kill the boy in the attic. You and 75% players did not kill him. Wow, that's a lot. Uh, let's see. Uh, did you lie or threaten Vernon? 58% of players were rational and honest. Yeah, makes sense. Did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? Yeah, 55%. And did you let Ben fall to his death? Ah. I feel like he was going to do fall anyways. And did you reveal your bite to the group? I mean, what, what's the point of hiding it? At this point, I'm going to turn eventually. Who came with you? Oh, wow. Oh, I could have just gone by myself. Wait. Wait, what's it? Wait, there was a chance to save Ben? Really? Huh. Wow.
uh, contemplate my choices. Well, that was episode four. Yep. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. So, uh, yeah. I did what I did. Uh -huh. Nah, we'll probably do the next one shortly, but yeah. Next episode. No time left. Mm -hmm. Alright. Yeah, no, I kind of feel bad about uh, getting Ben killed. Now that I think apparently there's a way to save him. Uh but yeah. Oh well, I uh, will live on with my choices. I mean, not really live, technically, since we got bit, but yeah, yeah. Alright, we just gotta move on. Mm -hmm. Gotta find Clem.